Well, 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 looky, 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 look who's made it here. The living room panner, house of panning in my living room. All right, folks, welcome everybody. This is the living room panner, and I am home. I have to tell y'all a story, but right after this, YouTube is in no way affiliated, sponsoring, or endorsing, my friends. This is all me. All right, well... As y'all may or may not know, I have had a pretty tough week. Uh, we have been doing a, a restaurant furniture installation. We spent the last two weeks building all this stuff. I have a team of five or six guys, and uh, starting this last mo this Monday past, we started doing the install, but the owner of the restaurant, it's a running restaurant, it's a pretty unique restaurant. They have a little cooking pot in each one of these tables for each person. They bring you a bowl of boiling or hot uh, soup base, I guess. It's a it's an oriental restaurant. It's called Shabu Zone, and uh, and you get to go up to a buffet line and pick out all kinds of seafood, vegetables, all kinds of stuff, and you just take it back to your table uh, and add it to your little soup pot. That's you could have a control on it to boil the water or whatever and you eat it it looks like they use chopsticks but kind of out of my my league i guess uh never experienced any food like that uh but it was pretty interesting well we're coming to the last day tomorrow is the final in install day and they have requested that we work till 10 30 in the mornings because that 11 people start showing up and they get busier than busy till 11 o'clock at night so it was either work from 11 at night all the way through the night or start at 5 a.m and be out of there by 10 30 so that's what we've been doing but my day's not over at 10 30. i have to drive back to the warehouse where i'm uh, working with this fella and prep load inspect uh get it get the next day's order all loaded on a truck and to make sure everything is done as well as can properly be done to be prepared for the next morning uh and then uh, the heavy marble tops are delivered at 8 a.m and they are heavy folks let me tell you and we have various sizes of them so that's what I've been up against, and that's been kicking my butt this week. I ain't going to lie to you. Yesterday evening, I came home, and I pretty much went straight to bed. Well, it, it was a long day today. Uh, my day, it starts at 3 a.m. At 4 a.m., I'm leaving. I'm on the job site at 5, and today I got home at 5.15. So, folks, it has been a long one. But I can tell you, I did get a little rest last night. I went to bed early, and I felt better this morning. But I'm dragging again this evening. So I already took a quick shower, thinking about something to eat, having a little adult refreshment, and fixing to give some stuff away, folks. So I appreciate y'all hearing me bellyache uh, and letting me vent for a moment. And hope y'all understand that uh, yesterday I was just a little bit too wiped out to keep this going. So we're continuing tonight. So it is time to give some stuff away. This is the 12 days of Christmas. And this is the 8th, uh, ninth day of giving. I'm confused. 8th day of giving, folks. And I got 103 people on the list that entered. I haven't even taken the time to see how many likes I got today. But uh, I'm sure it was quite a few. So if you entered the day before yesterday or, or yesterday, don't worry. You didn't miss anything. We're going to do the drawing tonight. And here's page one of all the entrants. So let's get this ball rolling, man. I'm tired and I'm ready to, to move on. But I can tell you, this weekend I'm off. And I'm already thinking about work for next week. It won't be no 5 a.m. stuff. I can promise you that. Uh, I'm not all about a 12-hour work day, much less drive times and all that, so that's fixing to be over, folks. All right, here we go. We're fixing to draw some stuff and give some stuff away. If y'all don't know what's going on, I give two first-place prizes, two second-place prizes, and two third-place prizes every night of this 12, nights, 12 days of Christmas giveaway. So we're going to draw a first-place first, first place prize right now. Nothing in the hand. 
And there are still 104 chips in the bucket, so let's let her rip. Take the chip. First chip out, 52. 52 is Scott Jarvey, longtime supporter. All right, congratulations, Scott. There you go, brother. I'm digging deep. White chip number 69. 69 is on page two, and that is. HMD, heavy metal detecting. There you go, brother. All right, first place. All right. And, Scott, you were the first first place, so you get first draw. All right, here we go, second place. Good luck, everybody. Thank you all for participating, man. This really means the world to me. Another white chip, 47. 47 is, num is Holly at... Uh, Holly, uh, there we go, second place, first, first pool, all right, congratulations, Holly. Next winner is another white chip, 73, 73 is page two again, trust the process, all right, you get a second place win, brother, congratulations, you're probably one of the most lucky people I've known on the YouTube channel. All right, here we go for third place. White chip number 97. I'm sorry, red chip number 97. All right, where are we at? 97 is Outdoor Wally. All right, Outdoor Wally, you got the first pick on uh, this third place draw. And I know what it is right here, third. All right, now for the second third place draw. Good luck, everybody. A lot of chips in here, folks. 35. Oh, wow. 35 is I Am Canadian. Third place, brother. Congratulations. All right. Well, let's put these chips back in the bucket. And just so y'all know, I write y'all's name down as they come in, in sequence, in order. And let me tell you, this one right here, number 35, I think this is the fourth time I pulled number 35. There it is. It's back in the bucket. All right. Congratulations, winners. All those that did not win, be ready for tomorrow. I'm fixing to post a new comment, and y'all can comment and get on tomorrow's entry for another six prize. All right. Here we go. Now, let me get my ducks in a row here. I got to transfer winners over. And I was thinking about capping the winners at at three wins per person, but I'm still contemplating that. I'm just not sure. But right now, I've got several people that have it hit twice already. So it's all good. Keep playing, folks. It, if you're lucky enough to win two times, three times, God bless you, man. It's your lucky day. Please go out and buy a lotto ticket, a scratch off or something. Because, man, things are happening for you. All right. So let's update. We got Scott Jarvey for the first first place. And there it goes. All right. And then the second first place went to HMD. And that's your second win, HMD. And HMD actually told me he didn't want to enter again. And I insisted upon him entering. In all fairness, I'm willing to give three prizes to each person at this point. So we'll move on to second place. And first second place is Holly. Congratulations. And the second second place was Trust the Process. All right, Trust. All right, and then the third, first third place was Outdoor Wally. And then the second, third place is I Am Can Canadian. All right, now we're going to go over to the uh, the prize numbers. All right, and I got the containers here, and I did double check them, mm, I don't know, the night before last, and there are eight prizes left in each each container, which is the right amount. So here we go. First place is this container. 
Shake them up real good. And Scott Jarvey, good luck to you, my man, and HMD as well. So here we go, folks. First, first place is number 14. And we'll look at that prize in just a second. And second, second place, I mean second, first place is 16. All right. And that takes care of all my first three draws for tonight. So there should be six left in there. That's three more nights of drawing. And then my second place winners. Here's your prize numbers. Holly and Trust Process. And Holly gets number six. All right. And Trust the Process. Good luck to you, brother. And he gets number 12. Okay, that's it for second places. All right, now for third place. Good luck. Outdoor Wally, man. You got prize number 15. And I am Canadian. You got prize number... 22. All right. Now, get that out of the way. We still got a few minutes to go here, folks, so bear with me. <laughs> I appreciate y'all's patience, man. I know this takes a little while, but hey, it's all worth it. All right. Now, we're going to flip this around and find our sponsor's prize list and see who gets what. All right, first is Scott Jarvey. He hit prize number 14, sponsored prize 14, that is. And that is uh, Sherry Ward, silver and copper, large pack. Awesome, my friend. And HMD, you hit prize number 16, first place. And Black Mass, you finally got off the list, brother. You were the last person that hadn't had a prize won out of all your donations. You got it right there, HMD, brother. You hit 42 bucks cash from Black Mass is donated and sponsored for. So congratulations on that. Uh, Holly, you got the first, first, second place, and you hit number six, and that is from Jules G. Uh, half a gram gold bar, one gold back, and a quarter ounce silver round. Pretty sweet score there, girl. Congratulations. Trust the process. You hit number 12 sponsor and that is thomas 907 a 0.35 gold pay dirt bag so congratulations on that and i'm not sure if you pan or not but if you don't just get in touch with me and we'll work something out all right third place prizes outdoor wally you hit number 15 and that is uh from john scott and that is a 1980 proof set and a 1966 SMS set. All right, congratulations on that. And I am Canadian. You hit prize 22. And that's that Walker half. So sweet from John Wolf. So nice, man. Everybody got some nice prizes tonight. I hope y'all like them. If not, let me know. We'll do some horse trading and we'll work something out. All right, now let's move on with the other stuff. Get this done. All right, eighth day is now done and we're on to the ninth day. Ninth day of Christmas. This is tomorrow e evening. So everybody tonight, has, between now and five o'clock tomorrow evening anyways, have to do this. These are the instructions for the ninth day of giving. First thing, please like, share, and sub. And I noticed when I talked about subbing the other night, or I'm sorry, sharing, that uh, several of y'all had shared my video and I gained a few subs and it, I heard from a few new people and man, that was awesome. I greatly appreciate y'all's efforts and time y'all put in for that. Uh, second, show a little love to the sponsors and donators one way or another in comments or whatever. Uh, third, Gmail me. This is the key thing, please. Participating in this giveaway has made me a winner. If you will Gmail me that statement right there, participating in this giveaway has made me a winner. Folks, 
everybody that's involved with this is a winner in my book. I greatly appreciate all y'all's support, participation, attention, likes, subs, everything. It's just been wonderful. And to, to top it all off, myself and all the, the sponsors, we're doing what we wanted to do, which was to give back to this wonderful, great community. This is a family. It seems like kind of a small family, but hey, we're pretty tight. And I love that. I love that about all of y'all. I love that about this whole giving thing. Uh, that's why I do it year round. I, I love giving back. I love the attention from YouTube. It's my second family. So folks, there it is. Like I say, in a nutshell. And uh, congratulations winners. This ain't over yet. We still got a nine day, 10 day, 11 day. And then on the 12th day, we're doing the bonus giveaways and the sponsor giveaways. So there's three more days of free giveaways and then the bonus giveaway at the end and sponsor giveaways on the 12th day. So stay tuned, folks. Keep up with this. Get on this list. I want to see everybody on here again. Thank you so much once again. Y'all have a great night. And I'm fixing to go to bed. I'll do my, I took my book to work the other day. And I did most of the uh, Gmail responses while I was at work. I kind of snuck it in here and there. Well, I'm going to do that again tomorrow. So I should be responding to a lot of people either early, early in the morning. I'll do about 15, 20 minutes of response. And then I'll do a bunch during the middle of the day. And then in the evening when I get home, I'll finish it up and respond to all of y'all. And you'll be on the list. So good luck to all of y'all. Again, I thank you all. Have a wonderful evening. And, you know, one of the most important things is Merry Christmas, man. Love to all. This is a special time of year. All right. Well, you know what the old panther says. Later, taters. <laughs>